Speaking of fired up, it is a shot where you are not guarded on the basketball court. The shot you may ask, it's called a free throw. It may seem like an easy shot, but for a few, the struggle is real when you are at the line. But for 10 year old Ty Willard of Bedford, he is making it look easy as he is one of several boys and girls between the ages of 8 and 13 heading to Chicago on Thursday to compete in the Elks Hoop Shoot National Final. And Ty is ready for the challenge. I oh, mean, sometimes when you don't have a good day, it's frustrating, but you just got to know that sometimes you're not going to be your best, but sometimes you are going to be your best. And when you are that, and when you are your best, you should really be happy that day. From the mouth of babes, 10-year-old Ty Willard, the pride of Bedford, is taking his skills as a free throw shooter to Chicago. And it started as elementary school. At school, my gym teacher, like, they just sent out notes if you want to do it, and I did it. And I just won in gym. And that's my second year doing this. Last year, I lost. Then I decided I just practice as hard as I can. So I went, and I went from losing and to the uh, local to making it to nationals. Each day, Ty takes hundreds of free throws, and it has helped him a lot, especially to where he shoots, whether it'll be inside or outside. Yeah, I think it's better practice shooting outside because, you know, if you make them outside, then you're definitely going to make even more inside. Overall, when it comes to the National Free Throw Shooting Contest coming up this week, Ty has some personal words of wisdom. I mean, it feels good. I feel like the work paid off. I'm happy. I mean, top 12 was pretty good, but top one would be even better. Indeed, I tell you, the way he was shooting those balls is pretty cool. Now, here's how it works. It's broken into two rounds. You shoot 10 free throws in round one, then you shoot uh, a total of 15 in round two. The winner makes most of the shots, obviously, is the winner. So the contest is Saturday, and we stream live on YouTube. We'll have all the details on WFXRTV.com. So good luck to Ty and the fam. All right, we're wishing him best of luck. Final check of